your resume will have all the projects in real time and you are going to get a job very soon in 2026. Now, those who are waiting for the free DevOps course and could not attend the last previous DevOps course, now this is the time for yourself to upskill with all the latest projects. But, but, but wait, before I tell about the project, you need to follow certain steps and register yourself to get all the Zoom links and sessions which are going to be live. Now, step one, you need to like the video and make sure you are hitting the likes of 200 plus on this video. Comment down DevOps and I'll be sharing this document. And the third step is share the channel link with your friends. And finally, the fourth step is you need to register in the link of the free DevOps course 4, which you will be seeing in the description. Now, hopefully you have done all the four steps. Now, let's get started into the video and let's understand how the things will be given to you on your plate so that you can keep the same things onto your resume to hunt for the best job in the market. So what are you waiting for? Let's get started one by one. So all of you see here, this is the free DevOps course completely led and uh, instructed by me your resumes, your projects, your details, your guidance, everything I will be taking care. So Please see here, this is the free 30 days of DevOps Bootcamp. And this is going to start from December 6, 2025 from 6 p.m. So you can see some of the links in the documents like my LinkedIn ID, my Instagram ID and the Telegram group. And also one important information, those who are registering in the link which I am giving below, you will have a WhatsApp group. So make sure you don't miss to join the WhatsApp group for further updates. Now, let's get into the projects. These are the projects which are going to be yours in the coming days. And I'll be telling you very basics to very advanced that you need to crack your job. So first of all, see here Linux Jenkins pipeline along with the deployment patterns, Elk stack integrations, log monitoring with the cluster setup we will do. You will have multi environment as your infrastructure using Terraform. Also, you will have deployment on Kates using different Kubernetes deployment strategies. So mostly in this bootcamp, you are going to have CI CD pipelines, you are going to have Elk stack monitoring, you are going to have Kubernetes. Along with that, you are going to have Linux and Terraform, which are the hottest criteria in the market for anyone to select your resume. Now you have seen the high level. Let's get deep dive into the low level components and the design diagram. So first of all, if you see here, this is the simple CI CD pipeline where your code is coming from the GitHub and then it is slowly moved into the Jenkins, Maven, Sonar Cube, Docker, Trivi, then your deployment onto the Kubernetes, very simple format, but yet very powerful for you to keep this project in the resume. Now, if you see here the project number two, different kinds of deployment strategies, as I have told you, you will have all the different types of deployment strategies onto your resume. You will understand how the Jenkins shared library is defined, how the Jenkins pipelines are created, what are the steps that you need to do, you need to take care for your groovy scripting to work. What are the different kinds of scenarios that you are going to handle in the real time? if you are going to join any company. Apart from this, you are also going to see the real time Kubernetes deployment. If you see how the entire structure is designed and laid off with the Docker getting integrated with the Sonar Cube getting integrated with the structured data flow, you will be able to see in this particular project. Now you will have a doubt Praveen, you are only telling about the project. Will you tell the theory? Yes, brother, I will tell you the theory. I will make sure you are understanding the theory and then move into the project section. And these sessions are going to be live on Zoom. Make sure you are understanding there will be no recorded sessions given to you. Only the project documents will be given to you. So make sure once you are registering for free, you are enrolling yourself and making sure you go to the course tab and get all the details of the sessions lined in. Apart from this, I am going to tell you those who are completing all the projects along with this 30 days of course, you are going to get a certificate of completion. Some of the modules will be recorded into this. Some of them will be the live session. So both of them will be there. But mostly I'm going to tell you the truth is that uh, all the sessions are live. If you are not able to join, probably we can have a poll or we can have a discussion whether you want the recordings or not. And based on the majority of the people say yes or no, we will be able to uh, procure those things also because everything comes with the cost because the storage, the ability to manage all those things comes with the cost. So we are just uh, making sure uh, it's little bit precautions are taking care. Okay. So once this is done, you will have the elk stack. So you all are aware Prometheus Grafana we have done so many times. Now it's a different space. We will be looking at elk stack, Elasticsearch, Logstash and Kibana. And as you are able to see, 
uh, file beat, metric beat, and pocket beat. We will be using file beat basically. It's a uh, it's a component in the monitoring segment uh, where, which will help your logs. Um, Maybe you can say like generated logs to able to read and process it to the elk stack component. So very, very important. You will have Kibana for the visualization. You will be able to understand how the things have been lined up for you, how the things are getting read from the other components like file beat and push to the elk stack component and how you are visualizing in the Kibana dashboard. So in the organizations like Verizon, the elk stack is very, very famous. So it has been used uh, primarily for monitoring the logs from the system. Some of the companies like Walmart uses this Splunk, right? So it's all about how you are integrating your applications and your logs from the systems and pushing it to the some metric space where the collection is done, aggregation is done and the presentation is done. So basically your Elk stack is doing that component log stash for reading the logs, um, elastic search uh, basically for making sure your cluster is set up and your search patterns are good, Ma basically aggregation, okay? So, and then Kibana, for showing the dashboard. So any components, if you see app dynamics also is based on this pattern itself. You have uh, collector, reader and aggregator. So same way, collector is the lock stash here, elastic search is the aggregator and Kibana is the, uh, 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 you can say like a dashboard component, okay? Now, automate infra setup in Azure using Terraform and Azure DevOps. So very important project. So. Uh, we will do hands-on on this. <coughs> we will try to understand how your Azure is done and each one of you will have your Azure accounts in this space and we will try to understand how your Azure infrastructure is getting created with the help of Terraform. Okay, so very exciting and very, very good project. So you can see here DevOps teams are there, Azure repos are there, Azure storage, Terraform state file, Microsoft Azure components and then with the help of Terraform, we are going to lay down uh, that particular aspects. Now, again, I am reiterating the things, uh, the four steps you need to do, like the video, share the channel link and comment on DevOps to get the document and fourth point, register yourself to get all the important updates and don't miss to join the WhatsApp group, which I have shared inside the course tab, which you will have. <laughs> okay. So any questions, any queries, make sure you are asking me in the comment section and December 6th is the time when you are going to have your first session. Once you uh, register yourself for free, make sure you get the Zoom links onto your uh, email ID. So everything will be rolled out on your plate. So what are you waiting for? See you all in this sessions and from maybe tomorrow or day after tomorrow, we will have a one to one connect with you all those who are getting registered. So let's see what happens next. So make sure you are joining and this is Praveen signing off from this video. Make sure you are liking the video and hitting the channel link for the bell icon subscribe button. So see you all in the DevOps space. Keep hunting the job, apply as many jobs as possible. LinkedIn, Insta, have Nokri and your other job portals are there for you. I'm seeing many jobs are getting open right now. Many companies are hiring. So what are you waiting for? Apply now and grab your opportunity. If you need any help, comment down in the comment section. So this is Praveen signing off from this video. Meet you in the next video. Until then, take care. Bye.